Hi ladies, we're here today to show you a quick premix of Kiss for Our Cause, our weekly color. So comment below if you can hear me and you see everything, everything's broadcasting right. We've been having some technical difficulties. So so today I just want to show you how to do a quick premix. Um, I bought these really convenient little, they're actually tattoo rings. Um, they have a reservoir on the end, and so I like to use that for pre-mixing. It just makes it super easy. You can also use a palette if you just have a piece of wax paper. Um, we sell blending palettes so that it doesn't absorb in. Um, hey, Bree, what's up? Thanks for coming on. I love when my friends join me. It's fun. Hey, but um, so I'm doing a quick pre-mix of Kiss for a Cause and a surprise color. So I have my little pre-mixing accessories. Uh, if anybody out there wants any of these, I have extras so I can mail them to you or drop them off or whatever. But I'm just going to show you how to do a quick premix of our color of the week, which is Kiss for a Cause. Now let me show you that. Isn't that beautiful? That's Kiss for a Cause. The second color that I'm going to add to the premix is a surprise. So, what we want to do when we do a premix is you can really do any combinations. <clears throat> which is super cool. It gives you so much versatility to mixing up this custom color. Um, today I think I'm going to do equal parts of Kiss for a Cause and my surprise color. Oh, it's the last day of school, huh? How exciting! My son goes year-round at this point in preschool, so, so you want to shake it up for those of you that haven't done this before. Clean, dry lips. So I'm going to mix Kiss for a Cause and, drum roll, Bella. One of my go-to colors that are just, it's a neutral, it mixes well, it's great by itself. It's actually one of my favorite colors. I like to call it our power color because um, anywhere from business executives all the way down to anybody else that just likes that neutral color. Um, hi, Dorothy. Thanks for coming on. So I'm doing a quick premix. I decided to premix our color of the week, Kiss for a Cause, with Bella. And Bella is called a neutral because it has brown undertones. It's neither cool nor warm. Um, I'm more of a cool person versus warm skin tone, but I've I just absolutely love some of the warms anyway. So you're not locked in just because you're cool or warm. So how's things going, Dorothy? When are you gonna come out and see the family? <laughs> we miss you. So, okay, guys, I won't waste your time today. I said five minutes, and I'm probably talking too much. So I'm going to shake my colors. First, what I'm going to do, I'm going to do equal parts. So I'm going to take my uh, Kiss for a Cause, and I'm going to put it into my little reservoir. And it usually takes a few swipes to get enough, so you have enough for the three layers. Always do three layers or more. That way... You get even coverage and get up to that 18 hour wear. So I have Kiss for a Cause in my little reservoir. If anybody wants any of these rings, they're really handy uh, for pre-mixing. Let me mix this one a little bit more here. Oh, first week of June. Awesome. I bet Sylvia is excited. My brother decided, Dorothy, to come out for Michigan. Um, I think it's like June 16th. But my brother's going to be coming out, and he hasn't met my daughter yet, which is super exciting. So again, here's Bella. Now I'm just doing three swipes of Bella. I'm going to do four. I'm not getting enough there. And then once I get the Kiss for a Cause and Bella into this reservoir, okay, did about equal parts this time. You can really do it however you want. You're the, the artist that decides how you want your makeup. So then I have a little reservoir and I have an extra clean tip. You want a disposable one because you don't want to use the applicator from one of the colors. Then you're mixing colors. So you want to mix them in the ring, not in the tube, right? So here we go. I'm going to mix Kiss for a Cause and Bella. I'm excited to see how this turns out. I haven't tried this color combination yet. So here we're going to do the first layer. And you really only use just a really thin amount for the layers. You want to go the same direction, keeping your lips apart. I 
and you want clean, dry lids. Hey, Amanda. We're getting our first coat on of Kiss for a Cause and Bella. I actually stole your idea. <laughs> uh, it sounded like a really fun, fun combo, so I'm going to give that a try. Let's get a little bit more on here. Hey, Daisy. What's up, girl? Thank you, girls, for hopping on. Just doing a quick premix today. Kiss for a Cause and Bella. Which Kiss for a Cause has been one of my one of my favorite colors lately that I've tried. <clears throat> it's really bold and bright and just kind of the, the pink that I, I really like the hotter pinks. Thank you. It's actually a dress. <laughs> it's one of my sundresses. I broke into my sundresses today, so get on another layer here. This is a really, it's like, it's its own new color, you guys. This is super cool. I got the little rings. Helps a lot with the premixing. I am loving this color, you guys. What do you think? So, Kiss for a Cause and Bella, and I actually... I'm a little new at pre-mixing, so I didn't quite put enough in. Um, hard to tell sometimes on the coverage. So I'm going to go ahead and do another swipe. What's nice about these little rings is that it gives you that edge to kind of rub things off on, which I didn't find when I was using the blending palettes. They were nice to use, but it seemed like it was harder to mix them easily. It, it just Maybe I didn't have the hang of it yet. So I'm going to do another swipe of Bella. Another swipe of Kiss for a Cause. And then... <laughs> You're wearing a dress today too, Amanda? Sweet. You're such a pretty lady. I've always loved your clothes. So I'm mixing up my Bella and my Kiss for a Cause. Since Kiss for a Cause is our color of the week, it's going for 10% off, ladies. And I'll even just do a special tonight till midnight and throw Bella in there for a 10% off this week. Just today, though, on the Bella. Hey, Renee, thanks for hopping on, girl. So what is everybody up to today besides watching me play with some makeup? <laughs> Hopefully you guys are having fun playing with some makeup, too. What color are you guys wearing today, Amanda? Daisy? So this is my last layer. Again, you can tell when the layers are dry because it's not sticky. And anybody that needs any of these extra rings or applicators, I have these available for you and I can ship them out. We also have our new beauty book that came in from Seminar Year and it has all of our new products in it. So if any of you want uh, a little shipment of beauty books, some samples, or any of the accessories, let me know. I can hook you up. To you all game in a bridal shower. Ooh. What are they going to do at the bridal shower? At least get my water line. Alright. So there's, let me top it off with my gloss before we take a look at it, but I think this is a new combo that I'm going to wear more often. I really like it. I am hot in here. I have got, we got our air conditioning going and it's not even June yet here in the desert, but whew, it's still warm. <laughs> My cheeks are all rosy. I don't even need blush. <laughs> hey, Sharice, what's up? Yay! You girls hopping on, it may, brings me so much joy. I have so much fun when you guys join me for these. Just doing a quick premix of the color of the week. <clears throat> oh, I bet you could spoil the bride, Amanda. So I'm just going to do glossy gloss. I did Kiss Her a Cause and Bella. I'm super excited about this, you guys. I've been using Bella for, I don't know, a year maybe and loving it to death. I haven't used it a lot in mixing with other colors. Mmm, look at this. I'm going to take some after pictures so you can get the gist of it, but I really love it. So that's super easy. You can pre-mix your colors. You can layer them. 
Um, because there's three layers, you could literally take three different colors, do one on the first layer, second, third, you get the idea. But with pre-mixing, you can literally pre-mix as many colors as you want to custom match your clothing or just be unique and have that custom color that nobody else is wearing. Isn't that awesome? This, this stuff just, I'm so excited. I know I'm all over the place, but it's super exciting because <clears throat> I've always worn cheap makeup and I've always been discouraged because of things about it that I just didn't like, um, especially the getting on my teeth part and wearing off and just having horrible ingredients that nobody needs to put on their body. So thank you. Thank you, ladies. I really like it too. So for all of you that haven't seen the kiss test, it is advertised as kiss proof, right? Nothing. Nada. And it won't come off when I eat or drink either, ladies. So this stuff is like magic. It's a product that I am definitely going to be using. Well, I have enough stock <laughs> that I'm probably going to use it for the rest of my life. Um, with the layering, if you just have two colors, that gives you eight different color combinations that you can pull off. If you have three colors, that's 27. Ladies, I have over 10 colors. I think I, I might have almost every single color from my own collection. And so I'm talking thousands of combinations. If you just have 10 colors which, okay, I'm in the, like, 40 to 50 colors range. Don't tell. <laughs> um, I'm kind of a lip sits addict, but if you even have 10 colors, you're talking about a 1,000 color combinations, okay? So these color combos are some serious business. You can do all kinds of stuff with this. So I won't keep you any longer, ladies. I just wanted to show you this color of the week, and I'll be hopping back on for a fun game here coming up that's going to run through Sunday. So stay tuned. I'm going to do some fun things on the group. And thank you, everybody, for coming on today. You're awesome. So have a good rest of your week. I know it's almost Friday. Woo! <laughs> and I'm going to sign off. So thank you, ladies. See you soon.